Coming up, Hulk Hogan's son lucky to be alive, seriously injured after getting into a high-speed car chase, or at least his passenger was seriously injured. Details straight ahead. Police investigating a horrific car accident, Clearwater, Florida, involving pro wrestler Hulk Hogan's son, 17-year-old Nick Hogan, released from the hospital today after the car he was driving hit a raised medium, flipped around, smashed into a palm tree. Police say Hogan was driving at a high rate of speed before the crash, and both he and a passenger had to be airlifted to a nearby hospital. The passenger remains in critical condition. FoxNews.com's Courtney Friel is here now with the very latest. Courtney. Hi, Greg. Of course, the big question about this car accident was racing involved. It's no secret that Nick Hogan, whose legal name is Nick Balea, is into drag racing. There are dozens of videos on YouTube of the 17-year-old drifting on tracks in souped-up cars. But Florida police say it's too early right now to tell what led to last night's accident, except that it was a spectacular wreck involving excessive speed. Witnesses told a Tampa TV station they saw the yellow Toyota Supra racing a silver Dodge Viper right before the crash at around 7. 7:30 p.m. It happened on State Route 60, the main drag through downtown Clearwater. The road had to be shut down in both directions for several hours. The Supra was completely destroyed, as you can see there. Both Balea and his passenger, 22-year-old John Graziano, had to be extricated from the car by paramedics. They were then airlifted to a nearby hospital, where Graziano remains in critical condition. Now, Balea appears on the reality TV show Hogan's, Hogan Knows Best with his father, pro wrestler Hulk Hogan, his mother Linda, and his sister Brooke. Cameras caught Hulk checking out the scene of the accident, and Linda has just released this statement saying, Nick is currently at the hospital with John and his family. His sole concern is for the well-being of his friend. On behalf of my family, we ask that your thoughts and prayers be with John and his loved ones. Now, police do not believe alcohol was involved. No charges have been filed, and the crash remains under investigation. However, it's not the first time that cops have been called to the scene of an accident with Hulk Hogan's son. It was reported last September that Nick was driving a Lamborghini in Florida when it burst into flames, but fire personnel described it as a normal car fire. Mm. John Graziano, the, the passenger, how badly injured is he? Well, his grandmother has just spoken out to the Tampa Tribune, and she says that it's not looking good, and they think that he might have brain damage because he's pretty incoherent right now. And it's unfortunate because he's a, a U.S. Marine. He just came back from Iraq last year, so oh, hoping for the best. Terrible. He saw, survives Iraq but not a uh, car crash here. Well, so far he's hanging on. Any word from Hulk Hogan? Uh, no, just the statement that uh, their thoughts are mm. to be with. All right. Courtney Friel, thanks very much. A troubling story. Thank you. That's going to do it for this hour. I'm Greg Jarrett, and for John Gibson, we thank you for watching, everybody.